Hello and welcome. I am the Restless Kaiser. And I am James Workshop. And together we are Modeling for Advantage. Advantage. We, <laughs> James, you've got this down. I have, I have. James, you brought something for me to play with uh -huh. today. So today we're going to be playing Beast Grave, which is the latest version of Warhammer Underworlds. Um, we basically haven't looked at it at all. I own it, I've, I've opened it, and I've taken things out of the packaging and that's it. We got our teeth on the cellophane not that long ago, didn't we? Yeah, I've still got some yeah. stuck in there, I think. <laughs> yeah, okay. So just a quick reaction yeah. uh, to what's going on in the box. So let's get this bad boy open and James see what's in there. Yep. So we have got. Ooh. So first reaction. It's there a couple is, box. It's a couple stuff, box, but there's no art for anything from the future. So when they, when they do some of these boxes, yeah. there's art around the outside of this inside edge. So oh, you can't see it straight away. Right. But you, do, you do end up it's getting like a previews little, of the models little, coming out and stuff. A little sneaky like. peeky. Mm -hmm. Let's pop that over there. So straight away we've got the rule book. Um, if you want to have a quick look at that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's got that kind of plasticky oh. new look. We got. I've got to say, because um, I just had a look at the Stormstrike box recently. Yeah. I think the production values of these have gone up a lot, James. Yeah. yeah just you know the layout, the mm -hmm. colours, they look okay. nice. If you've seen that little first strike booklet, it's quite nice. Yeah. But this is way better. Okay. All right. Maybe they just put more effort into it. To be honest. Yeah. Oh, first oh. strike. I'm not sure they expected that to be quite the success. It was. <laughs> well, it's an excellent hands. way to learn Warhammer 40k. Yeah. So uh, right. we've got a little. This was just the beginning booklet. Which is an advertisement for Age of Sigma. Go and play Sigma. Yep. You're right. We've got your uh, Build a Beast book, which is specifically for beasts this time. And where would someone find Build a Beasts then? Are they, are they in Build North America? Or? They are, yes. <laughs> or, or is that a shop like the Build a Bear workshop? Did yeah. You? We should do that. We mate. should do a Build a Beast build workshop. Build a Beast. God, stop saying you're going to do things in the future. You just oh, yeah. said that. Yeah, yeah. stop making commitments. <laughs> We've got the Learn to Play book. Uh, we'll have a quick <laughs> flick through this in a minute. Only for Vantage trademark that Build a Beast workshop, yeah, by the way. <laughs> TMRC, everything it's you can It's mine. Fit. Yeah, we'll have a quick look at that in a minute so we yeah, can see the yeah. new rules changes. So we've got. Your boards. So we've got the two, two new boards. boards. And we've got all the oh, tokens. I, you know what? I hadn't quite mastered the the technical nature of the which <laughs> board goes where thing. But nice. Ah. Oh. Yeah. So there's more, there's a, like a boneyard type theme, dragons, dead mm -hmm. dragons lair on yep. one side, which is nice. Yeah, and a wiggly uh, wobbly sarlacc pit on the other side with a giant yeah. dead. Giant dead nautilus on yeah, it. Sp there. Spider. Um, uh, Ammonite. <laughs> yeah, whatever that Interesting. is. Interesting. I didn't want to meet you when I was alive, I know that much. No. Uh, yeah, so these, so are, these are nice. They're there's different than new. There's red hexes yeah. and white hexes, so they maybe it's, that's impassable and, and yeah. dangerous. Dangerous and impassable, yeah. Nice. New boards always good. New boards are always good, new options. New then we've got options. our tokens. tokens. Um, so these look familiar. These are new. So we've got whatever these, again, Sarlacc pit looking things are. Oh yeah, so you that, that's had a thing in June, isn't it? Yeah, a little bit. Good sandworm. And another new one on the back of that one as well, which is interesting. Right. Okay. But otherwise we've got objective markers, glory, yeah, and on guard, move. Flip it over, there's gems. Gems. There's gems. Oh, gems. Oh, is this a new mechanic? Or is that a relic? Let's thing? find out. <laughs> I have we'll find out. no idea. All right. Is. That's is fun. Do you have cool. a quick look at the models and then we get Let's these guys built and have a game, yeah? And then we'll get them built. I looked at the rule, but look. So we've got the two new teams. Um, where is the Builder Bear? Because we can work out what they're beast. called. I think. Oh no, no idea. Okay. So we've got what, uh, basically feral elves. Yes. Of some kind, which are satyr-esque, in that they have hooves, which was kind of interesting. Yeah. Didn't so expect that at first. this is GW's sort of branded uh, wood elf, mm -hmm. but they're not like elves nice with bows and no, stuff. No. They're a bit more savage fe or feral. Mm -hmm. And then we've got the beastmen. Beastmen. They've got new terms these days. Beastmen, beastmen. Beast beast they're beastmen. As in Chaos Marauders beastmen. As in Chaos Marauders beastmen. Oh, mate. Uh, can I be them? Yeah, you can go with them if you like. Go with them. These elves look like they're going to snap to pieces. They do. Nothing. Yeah, they do look quite fragile. Let's get to that remark soon. So they're called... Grashrax Despoilers. Grashrax Despoilers and... Gates Wild Gates Hunt. Wild Hunt. There's even some wisdom about them in there. Yeah, yeah wow. look at that wisdom. Huh. I assume this is Scaith, this big fella on, who's half wisdom. horse. Centaur. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Yeah. So right. we, yeah. And some spare baggies. We've which got spare baggies. Nice. Yeah, we'll pop them over there. So we've got dice. There's the same dice as we had in the previous set, including magic dice. So, assumedly, there will be magic in Beast Grave. 
And yeah, we've got little baggies. We've got the two sets of new cards, which are shown in the format that they tend to show them now, which is like, this is ready to go, just play with these cards, don't mark yes. them, don't touch them. So we're going to play one game with those, yeah, and then maybe one where we mix it up. With the extra cards. With extra cards! Extra cards, oh, cards say it's extra cards, in case you're not sure. It literally says extra cards on it. So that's so. them. The only thing we have left remaining in the box is uh, Beast Grave. Oh, it's the sample chapter that you were talking about earlier, oh. and now it's digital, and it has a, a little QR thingy. Digital books, man. Digital books. The librarian in me yeah. just wants to vomit. It's the future, man. It's not the future. It's the future. It was someone's idea of the future in the late 90s. Nah, papers. The past, man. Right, We, we so sell more books than we used to. We do, actually, yeah, don't we? The, the, yeah. the proportion. Uh, they don't care. We also sell <laughs> a lot more vinyl than we used to, but that's... Yes. Yeah, let's not talk about that. Right, so, um, let's take a quick break, then. We'll be back with Built Models and a game. So, welcome back, here we are. Uh, I am the Restless Kaiser over here. And I am James Workshop over here. Can you see me? I can't see me. You, no, your hands are oh, off. There you go, I'm over yeah. here. Your hand was too high, James. Uh. Uh, so, I over here will be playing Grashrax Despoilers, who are beast men to you and I. Yeah, uh, and I'll be playing Scath, 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 choose how you want to pronounce it, Scath's Wild Hunt. The Wild Hunt, which are feral elves. Yeah, so the then in a new Wood Elf thing. Yeah. So um, for the sake of the camera and the fact that this is a sort of introductory game, we're going to leave the boards as they are. So we're going to roll off for objectives now. Is that right, James? Uh, we roll off to see who places first board. So yeah, we roll off for objectives. In the roll off for yeah. objectives. Whoever wins this. I've got two crits. I've got one, so you win. So I'll be placing the first objective, and the objectives have to go not within two of the edge. Is that yeah, correct? Yeah, that's correct. Or not within one of the edge? Not within one of the edge. Or within two of each other. Except the final objective, which can be placed on an edge hex. So that can go there? Yeah, and I will place this one. I think I want to be near you. I mean, come for me. You're all about galloping hooves, aren't you? Yeah, so I'm going to put that there. Uh, so this one, not within two of each other. Mm -hmm. So it can't go there, because it's within That's one. That's an edge hex, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm a bit can't limp. go on an edge hex. Oh, so it can go here. Um, it can't go adjacent to an edge hex, and I believe this is an edge hex. Yeah. So it'd have to go there. Yeah. Oh, I don't want it to go there. No, I, I didn't think about this thoroughly enough. Right. Um, I'm going to place that one there. And this one can go on an edge hex. It can go on an edge hex. So I can put this all the way over here? Yes, you could. Yeah. All right, let's that, reveal. That, that's what you're going to do? That's okay. what I'm going to do, okay. yeah. So we've not played the decks that we have here. No, we're straight out of fresh. Straight out of the box, so yeah. As a little pre-game thing, there are some new rules in these war bands. So I have a ritual token. Yes, I have here. a horn token. I've got the horn token. Um, mine... My ritual allows me to, it, when I get one at the start of the game and every time a model dies, and it allows me to give a re-roll to a friendly fighter. Uh, my horn token gets put onto the card. When there is a horn counter on the card, I can re-roll any number of dice in the next attack roll made for a friendly fighter's attack action, then remove the horn token. So it's exactly so, the same. Yeah, an action to place the token and then, yeah. Excellent. Okay. Um, How do you get new tokens? I use the action. Ah. Yeah. Ah, so you can just get one whenever you want yes. one. Where yours is a reaction, right? Yes, but I gain them by killing models. Ah, okay. Cool. And I um, inspire by you having lost two models. But you can have multiple ritual tokens presumably yes whereas i can only ever have one horn token at a time right so it's easy for me to get them but i have less of them whereas yeah. yours is i'd say substantially more difficult to get them but you yes. can have multiple yes. if you're lucky uh, my inspiration is if I, they have a charge token at the end of a phase that's it quite easy to inspire yeah. you don't but at the end of the phase you. you don't inspire you don't fight inspired no, you have to. You'll be locked in combat. Yeah, and you'll yeah. you'll be inspired. Okay, so cards, cards. Yep. Is it five grey, five yep. gambits, and three objectives? Three objectives. Yeah. Not even looked at these and taken them out of the wrapper. Not even slightly. Shuffled yeah. them, and they could all be trash. 
Oof. That's not great, but oh, I don't know if that's great. <laughs> you know what, that seems fine. I am trashing mine. I'll keep that, I don't know. Not if it's feel good, good about them. So let's see the next three. And mulligan. And objectives wise. Oh, that's difficult. That's nightmarish. Nope. They can all get binned. Oh. I don't rate these objectives. <laughs> <laughs> so mine were single point objectives that I, I needed to push you into a lethal hex. I needed to get that objective. Five. Oh yeah. And um, take an enemy fighter standing in the same hex as an objective out of an out of action. But, yeah, I didn't rate them. I think considering how this game works, I'm gonna just need to hard keep these. I'm getting rid of those five gambits as well. Oof. Yep, yep, and probably not, but okay. Yeah, I'll keep those. And I'll keep these, because I'm a brave man. Brave, stupid, you choose. I, I realise now what I've just done. <laughs> what? I've, I've, I've misread the logos, but that's all right. Okay, cool. Learning experience. Yeah. So we're going to roll off to see who's... Yeah, place the first one. Is that we roll off to see who chooses who places the first. So you, we both got one of them, and we both two got two of them. Let's just re-roll. Re -roll. It's too oh, complicated okay. for me now. I've got two you, crits. You've got two crits. There you go. Okay. I think so you, you should choose. place the first model. We'll place the first model. So I don't know how to play this at all. Brand new team. But I need to charge. Mm. So I'm going to put. Um, Gaelic name Kernoth Tracker, right there. Shayok. Let's go with that. Put a bomb in here. They're fictional names, I can't offend anybody, can I? So uh, this is Althean. There's always the risk that they're actually like Irish Gaelic names or something. Yeah. And I'll put the other one here. Then I'm going to put Legain. Legain. Liam. Liam. There you go. There I can go there. <laughs> I'm going to put Kosh the Sneak here. Uh, we have got Carthion Hunt Caller, who is the horn. So I want to protect that a little bit. Back there. Murgoth Half Horn is going. You only got half horn, yeah. I got a whole horn. Do you know what I mean? And Scarf the Huntsman. Is it a very attractive model? Um, moves, very nice. Moves very Is it the first quickly. cavalry piece in the game? Oh, that's a big question. I think so. I can't think of one. No, I think that's the first. That's the. Well, is it a cavalry piece if it's a centaur? But yeah, Ooh. it's the first. <laughs> the first horse-shaped object. Grishnak, fell hoof. He's going to go over here. He's my shaman dude. Not to be confused with the band, of course. No. <laughs> and then Draknar will go over here. That's your besties. As my big beast man choppy dude. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's that started. So we uh, we roll up. Whoever now, do you get a bonus crit for having finished yes. the playing first? Yes. So I have one, one crit. And I also get one. So I have no supports. To, I've got two doubles. So, so I, you, I go first. You go first. Right, let's do it. So, do I just charge and see what happens? How many wounds have my guys got? Not enough to do that safely. Um, ah, screw it. Let's go for it. So this, this fine gentleman, mm -hmm. lady gentleman, it's very difficult to tell from this angle, is... This fighter. Shayok, this fighter is going to charge to here. So your charge token. Where are they gone? Oh, there. And then I do a fight. You fight on two dice. Range one, two dice, two and damage. This one is Murgoth Halfhorn. He has 
All right, nothing happens anyway. <laughs> it's shield, uh, dodge one. If we got that far, which we didn't, I, I did absolutely nothing. Okay. Oh, the defense is down the bottom. Yeah, yep. so I'll so that's my first activation to yours, sir. Right. So, I need to look at my objectives. How many, uh, how many was it? <laughs> how many what? Wounds does that character have? Three. Three. Okay. So, Draknor has a three damage attack. It's a three damage attack. And still moves four. That is yeah. very good. Murgoth Harfon, that's him. He has a two damage attack. Yes. I think there might be some value in just attacking you. The problem is, how many yeah. defense do you have? Uh, it's going to be one, oh. one. One dodge. Actually, no. The Shaman. Oh. Got to think about all the other things. Shaman has range do. one. Shaman has range one. Whereas these guys have range three with their bows. Yes, but they only do the one damage. Hmm. I think he might just attack from where he is. Yeah. The attack dice are the white one, yeah? Oh no, I've not got any supports. That's what was troubling me. Oh, okay, right, right, right. Right, so this one is this one. So if he has a move of... Four. Four. Yeah, plenty. So I'm going to charge to here. Yep. Wherever the charge tokens are. I'll grab one. You do the roll. Yeah. So that is the sneak. He only has, he has two attacks on swords. Two on they swords. only do one damage. Got a swords and, and a, a support. support. Oof. So I've got a get a you crit, got a basically. on the defense dice. Yeah. Nope. There's Just one one, one block, but yeah, still still goes through for one damage. So it's down to two on Shack. Good off the tracker. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. So my oh two three yeah I should have done yeah. that didn't I. My Huntsman is going to charge. Oh, can he charge all that way? It's got movement five. Nice. Five. Five? That's ridiculous. And what's his range? Range one still? Does have a range three attack? It only does one damage. Mm. Because he's lobbing his javelin at you. Yes. Rather than poking you with it. Well, I only get one defense dice and you, you do. do. Um, I got two on three, axes. Three attacks. Three on... So oh, three on the secondary attack. Yep. Javelin, then attack once per game, as well as one damage is made part of charge attack. Okay, now I won't use that. Well, this guy's only got two wounds, it seems. I did dodge. A crit. But you crit. Yeah. And he dies. So that's two damage. That's two wounds. Ooh. Two wounds, yeah. Glory! He's out. My second activation. So then we go to the end. See if we want to use any cards. No, he's the other one. Oh, I did that all wrong. Did you? Yeah. He is half horn because he's not got the wooden stick. And so he, he actually did two damage and he has three wounds. Well, that gentleman is dangerous in comparison. Yeah. Okay. So, so I he's just taken two. Just taken two. Yeah, and I, have, I need that charge token back. Right. Yeah, because he's not dead. Yep. And you didn't get a glory. I'm going to equip, uh, I did not get a glory. You did not get a glory, then you will not equip. That's fine. Yeah. So None of these are at the end of an attack action or something. Nope. Okay, so, um, now, oh dear, 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 dear. The range it's one. of these attacks. Also that guy's charged. Yeah. <laughs> These can shoot three. They can. Three activations. Okay. So this guy will move to here mm -hmm. and shoot this one. 
So a charge action. It's a charge action, that's called, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> and that guy is the one with the bow across his chest. Now that is Ushko the Hunter, and he has two, two on swords. On swords. Pair, pair of hammers. Pair of hammers, there you go. Okay. Second activation done. Right, so onto my field. Um, I'm going to fire this bow over here. Okay. Which is two, probably. So that is two or no Okay. Yeah, the injured one. The injured one. That's not his name. And you've got a pair of crits. I can't beat that. No. So okay. that one is now death. So that's, that's, that's now a death. That's Excellent. now definitely a death. So that is actually one of them. Which I will spend. <laughs> Which you will spend. Uh, on the hail charm for a hunter, presumably. Who's hunter? Restricted hunter. Hunter, hunter, hunter. Oh, my leader is a hunter. Okay. They've got the secondary keywords. That confused me. So, my leader, when this fighter is dealt damage, reduce that damage by one to a minimum of one. Yeah. Mm. So now he takes less damage. Although most of your stuff is one damage at the moment. Until you've taken out two of my guys. Yes. Two of my fighters. Uh, yeah, that's your turn there. That was my third activation. Okay. I'll move here. Yep. So my final activation will be... I think charge. Mm -hmm. You've got an activation, haven't you? I've got one left. I'm going to charge to here. And I'm going to use a spell gambit. And uh, this guy can do magic? Yeah, magic caster one. Nice. Yeah, that, I didn't expect that either. Uh, I need to get a single swirly. Mm -hmm. If I do, so I'm targeting big boy. You're targeting Dragnar. There's a single swirly. I don't get it, sadly. Uh, if I did, it would have given it a, f a move token. Given him a move token? It would have given that a move Preventing token. Preventing him from moving. Yep, so that's, that's good. That would have been nice. Okay. I guess in my final activation, I make a charge action to here. Yeah. And shoot the only model in range. Okay. And this is... Other guy with the bow. Narl. Yeah. Who has two dice doing one damage. Okay. And on swords. That is one hit. Okay. There's two dodge. Two dodge. Two dodge. Different world. Uh, and it worked. And it, blo it blocked. Wow. I score for despoilers. Score mm. immediately after an activation if your warband holds three objectives. Okay. So I score this one gaining two glory. Immediately after an activation. So you would have held that as soon as you held three, which I guess is now. Yeah. 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 Uh, uh, I have... Is this the discard pile? Hold objective three. This is still my guard. I can still play gambits though, right? Yes. Yeah? With with these two glory? Uh, yeah. You can equip cards. And do I have any... That's spent. Just clarify for me, is this my leader or this one? How do this I know? This is your leader because it's got the little crown in the name. Got the crown in the name. Right.
I will put great fortitude on Crash Neck. Crash Neck. Giving him an extra wound. Okay. Do you have one to play? Nope. I will. Okay, I will leave it there. Yep, uh, I've got nothing to play. So in the end step, roll on. Uh, I am going to give Dragnar great speed. Plus two? Plus, Plus one. one. Plus okay. one there. To his speed using my other glory. Yep. I hold objective three. Or do I? No. no I don't. Haha, I give that away. <laughs> I held objective four. <laughs> which is a glory, which I will immediately spend. What, sorry, what, you, for holding objective four? Four, yeah, I got them. Gave my hand away somewhat. Which is which one? That one. Okay. Going to give Sky the Huntsman plus two move. Plus two move. Plus two move. So it's now movement seven. These are very mobile warbands, aren't they? These two. Yeah, both of them are. It's very notable. Uh, oh, these two had charge tokens at the end of the phase. Mm. Oh, so they inspired. So they're inspired. Which might even pump this guy even more. So what's the difference, ladies and gentlemen? Scything, that's new. I think that's the um, attack everybody in an adjacent ah, hex. okay, cool. There were models that did it before, but now they've given it a name. Okay. It was quite common to put that on quite so many cards. So now the attack is the same, but has Scything. That's still pretty good. It's pretty rad. And gone up to shield two as defense as well. Oh, Oof. this game keeps getting harder for me. Right. So in the end step, can we discard? You can discard any number and then draw up to the number you're supposed to have. Discard any number of both types or only gambits? Uh, both types. Both types. So I can discard that. And... <laughs> Can achieve that. Ooh, discard that. That's difficult. I'll, mm, no, I'll draw one no objective. Okay. We should have five gambits, right? Yeah, for up to five. Oh no. Oh no. Ooh. Okay, that could be worse. Scything. Interesting. Abby? Ah, oh, that's one way of looking at it. <laughs> so, let's roll them up. Let's roll them up. So, I, I have, have a crit. I've got nothing. Okay, so do I get the first action? You get to choose. I get to choose. Yeah, I'm taking the first action. That's totally fine. Uh, so this guy is going to kill this fella. Give it a go. go He's, on, what's it though? He's inspired now, isn't he? Uh, Your guy. Yeah. Because he made a charge action. It's this one. And my chap is Kosh the Sneak. So he's got one more movement and the attack has gained cleave. Ooh. So that cuts through armor, which is not your primary, but your big guy has armor. So, uh, I will. Now, if this guy attacks, mm -hmm. he doesn't get support. Whereas if this guy shoots, 
He does get support. He does get support. And you only need that to do one guy, damage. Yes, it's about it's about probability, isn't it? That guy's got they've got the same attack dice, so I'll shoot with this guy. Yeah, because you get the support. Because I get the support. Which mattered. I've got two Two successes. Oh no, that's only if I've got double That's only spot. if you've got yeah, you need so two, one success. Two folks. Which I stopped. Okay, that well, was I've my been action. Lucky this game. Uh, uh, I will take a charge action with my leader. Okay. No, no, I won't. Let's stack these things up a little bit better first. Oh, I achieved an objective. I hold objective three at the end of my activation. Yeah? That's an end phase, not activation. You need to wait to the end of the. Once we've spent all of these. Oh, really? That's a, that's a phase. That's a phase. Yeah. Wow. That was. Yeah. A big deal. I, if it's any consolation, you will show know that I have hold objective three. <laughs> so I'm going for it either way. Yeah. Um, do I just go for it? How many wounds do these two guys have? Is it a two wound uh, person? I think they're both. The sneak, which is the guy with the spear holding onto the stick, yeah. has two wounds. Yep. Yeah. And Both bowmen have two wounds, okay. Both uh, bowmen have two wounds, yeah. Not much point in me mucking about too hard then. So I'm going to charge to here. Okay. I think to there. Yeah, to there. All right. It's a little more defensive. So with the scything attack, I'm going to attack um, this gentleman first. And that gentleman is the sneak, and he has one defense dice, which okay. is dodge. I crit. I crit. I and you didn't. Do not crit. So he lives. Yeah. Um, what's two successes against a crit? It's just not the failure, isn't it? So the next. Uh, there's also one dodge. So that's. You've got one hit. No success. Are you swords? It's on swords, yeah. Oh! No and full, you charged there. Full survival, yeah. So that's that done. That's that guy finished for the turn. Right. Cards. Mm, not from me. Uh, right, so I'll listen to this. Okay. Uh, Blood Torn. Choose a friendly fighter. Yes. They are dealt one damage. Okay. Give them a guard token. Right. Plus two dice to the first attack action made by that fighter in the next activation. Yep. If you have a guard token, you you can't fight, can you? Or you can't move? I don't think you can move. Right. God. Well, it'd make no sense if you couldn't fight. Really wouldn't. Right, so yeah, I will play that in your turn. Okay. That gambit. Which, uh... Give them a guard token. If you make a charge, you remove it. Otherwise, you keep it. Oh, really? Yeah. So, he's on guard. On guard. But has taken one damage. Okay. Down to one. Down to one. But he's dead anyway from just about any of your guys. Huh? Um... Yeah, there's a good amount of one damage that range. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but that was the gambit, so he can attack with many more dice next time, though. Many more dice. Two more. Two more. Two, too many. So in my <laughs> activation, yeah. I shall do precisely that. Okie dokie. Uh, with a bow, presumably, or does he have a stabber? He's got a stabber, but it doesn't give him any advantage. Uh, no, so this guy will do it because he's got the extra... He's the one with the dice as well. Right, yeah. So I get four attack dice. Who must are you attacking? The, the guy with one wound, because he still only does one damage. Yep. But I did get a crit and a hit. A crit and a hit. You can't beat that, can uh, you? Oh, you got two... Did you have two dice? Yeah, yeah. Two dodge. And a yeah, support, actually. Oh, wait. No, I've got... You need two crits. Yeah. 
Which I can't get. No, I've only got one dice. All right. Okay. Yep. So I kill him. Killed. Killed him Ooh. dead. Glory. Glory! Glory, glory, hallelujah. hallelujah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, so with my glory... So I've made one activation so far. I will make my bad boy blood crazed. Bad boy. Uh, he's blood crazed. Which does what? Uh, he does technical things if he's got more damage. Okay. <laughs> Plus one damage is range one and range two attack actions if he has one or more wounds and is a and or is adjacent to a wounded person. So if he's wounded or you're wounded, he gets plus one. Okay. Damage. Yep. And that one's done. And that was that glory. And that was my second activation. Yep. Okay. So I'm going to move the this guy, uh, Carthane, mm -hmm. up to four. This guy hasn't attacked yet, has he? He hasn't moved yet. He hasn't moved yet. There's four, sorry. <laughs> yeah, if that was a question, um, that is indeed That is four. definitely 100%. No, I'll put it there. Not that I have. Yeah. Um, is this a charge or is this not a charge? This is a charge. Has this guy got a range three attack? No, but he can cast spells. Right, yes. So Do the magic. Do the magic. So it's a gambit spell. If cast, choose a friend. Well, if cast. No, it's not. No. He does, however, inspire because he charged. Yeah, that was kind of my intention. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, where's at the end of the at the end of an activation or end of the phase? End. This phase is not over yet. No. So yeah, pass. At the end of the phase. End of the phase. So we are currently in the action phase. Right. Yeah, I think this is the action phase, so I need to wait until everything's done. I can't help but feel we might have been doing some of this wrong. Uh, you've got two more activations. Two left, sorry, yeah. Two left. Right. How many wounds has your bad boy got? My big bad boy's got four wounds, and if you do more than one damage, it gets reduced back down to one. Straight, or, flat uh, down to one? Or? Minus one down to one. So if you do three damage, it goes down to two. But I don't think you have anything that does three damage except from big boy. Okay, so this guy's going to stab then. Yeah, go for a stab. Uh, one hit. One hit. Did you say you had two dodge? I've got two shield. Two shield. You don't have cleave, do you? You crit. got a crit. Crit and a shield. Yep. So my activation will be number three. Um. I'm going to move. I really, I really don't want to charge, but I think I have to, just to get the glory. Not the glory, the... Uh, the inspire. The inspiration. What I was hoping to do was increase the damage on this guy so I could charge over there and hurt him. But now it's only one damage. Oh, that's what your spell was? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because it's full-time bow. 
There's no close combat weapon on that one. It doesn't get any better when you inspire either. It has ensnare, whatever that means. Let's work that one out <laughs> when it becomes relevant. Um, okay. Uh, this guy's only got one wound left, hasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Well, let's just take him out then. We'll give it a go. You're going to shoot him? Yeah, I'm going to shoot over. He's on guard though. Yeah. With two looking for hammers. One hammer. That blocks. There's my third activation. Okay, so that's my suboptimal. Fourth activation. <coughs> uh, I'm gonna move to here. Okay. Not happy about that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, fourth activation. Yep. Yeah. Uh, charge. <laughs> sneaky sneaky charge uh, no I will charge to there I think actually yep and you're shooting this guy again shooting that guy again mm. I might just ping over there actually I can't do two damage though might as well try might as well try so that's one one success I'm uh, supported you do have a support so that's that hey and that's that step that's that then. over yeah so now we're in the end we could play gambits and stuff from your actions. I've got nothing. I've got nothing there. It's been terrible for cards. I guess because we didn't build the decks. We didn't build the decks, no. And we don't know them either. No, and I think that makes um, more difference. So both of these guys inspire. Okay, yeah. Mine don't, because there aren't two of you dead. I hold objectives three and four. So I get... More magic -y. Oh, I should have saved up my spells. I didn't know that. It's three damage as well. That guy's good. Two glory. Huh. And yeah, I need to look up what ensnare means because that's a new one to me. Because mm. this is the final round, isn't it? Yeah. Ensnare. If an attack action is noted as having ensnare, rolls of a dodge cannot be successes on the defense roll. It's um, uh, rend. Cleave. Cleave. It's cleave, but for dodges rather than shields. Yeah. Makes uh, sense. So it does. So. Well, you want five points? Yeah, I'm not looking great. I am drawing two objective cards. That's Doing from that. my discarded objective bar. Oh, did I get any objectives? That'd be super helpful to work out. No. None of these. Oh. Um, all of them. Oh, no. Oh, wrong pile. Bad news, Baz? Yeah. Bad news, man. So I want two of those. And three oh, of these. These are not the best. Well, you're winning by three already, so you've got a bit of an advantage. God. Okay, cool. Would have been nice earlier. I am going to... Spend the glory to equip Felhoof with a Savage Bolt. So that is a magical attack that does one damage at range three. Okay. Savage Bolt. I've got no spare glory for which to do these things with. Uh, you need to do that at the end of an activation. You can't do that once you've drawn new cards. Oh. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. Yeah. So now we need to roll off to see who gets their activation. If you're not, there's nothing yeah, you can there, do now. now I, couldn't, I couldn't spend that glory. That you, had. you could have spent the two have equipped. Right, so I will spend it on one that I already had. Okay, I'm yeah. happy to believe you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, great strength, um, plus one damage. So I'm going to put that on Felhu. Okay. Uh, no, no you want to put that on your, your yeah. proper fighter. In the hope of getting killing blows. Mm -hmm. That's plus one damage. Plus one damage. So it does four now. Uh, he's on. F he does five damage now. He does five. If he's wounded or the target is wounded. Yeah. It's four. Um, Paracrits. Paracrits. And one crit. One crit. So are you going to take the first action? I will take the first action. You sure? Did I lose this guard token or do I keep it until uh, I charge? Until end of phase, I believe. 
The viewers will know. I'm happy with that. I'm not. I'm not yeah, complaining. Yeah, that's how I feel. It yeah. works. No, <laughs> I'm not basing it on my emotions. I just mean yeah, yeah, yeah. that's how I'm pretty sure it works. Okay. So. Uh, charge. How many wounds? Four. Three. Three. For your big dude? Yeah. I put great fortitude on the wrong guy. <laughs> Charge? Yeah, and he's only got one shield. <laughs> okay. So I've got an attack on two hammers. It's a crit, uh, hammer. Sorry, just one. That's the wrong dice. Yeah, that is. <sighs> Nothing. No. Three damage. damage. Three damage. Do you do three damage? Three. Not joking. Three three damage. Oh, mate, you just crushed me. <laughs> Let me just double check. Oh, no, the wounds. No, I wasn't. I, I don't think I'd realised he only had three wounds either. Oh. So, um, yeah. Bye. Bye. <laughs> All right. Later, taters. <laughs> okay. That took me a bit by surprise. That didn't feel right. None of that felt right. <laughs> um, okay, not that. Not that. Not that. Um, maybe one of these. Okay. Uh, I'm going to give fast shot to Alphian, which means that when Alphian does a uh, shooty attack, uh, I do another shooty attack straight afterwards. Okay. That's what I'm spending. That's all I've got. Your turn, sir. I think I've got a serious problem now. <laughs> Which of these is the weakest? Um, the dog. The wolf. Hence why it's done nothing all game. Because it's got rubbish attack and also rubbish wounds. Can claim objectives though, unlike some of these. And its attacks do have ensnare when, the, when it finishes. That's alright. It's, it's not MVP. A serious problem. I have got a serious problem. <laughs> that was a charge. So no more over there. Means I can't be horny anymore. Okay. I'm gonna shoot this guy here. Okay. Is it on hammers or nope. swords? No? Okay. Uh you get to choose a card first? No. No? Oh uh I'll tell you what, I will equip bad boy with the savage bolt. Not that he's ever going to get to use it. Okay. I'm going to charge. This guy's just shot, right? Yeah. It doesn't matter anyway. Charge to there. Yeah. I'm going to fire over here. Okay. So attack action one. Is on hammers. Is it? And you're on dodge with that guy? No. It's not a crit. So that's one damage. One damage. But then because of the card, I'll use my reaction to go again. Okay, okay. So that's two hammers again. <laughs> two hammers need, need again. A not a crit. So down he goes. Uh, <laughs> pulling this back in the last minute. You certainly are, sir. Right. I think I've got an equipment to equip. Equipedly. Yeah. Um, Knockback one on... I've just messed this up. Doesn't matter. Knockback one on my leader. So you've done... Two activations, yeah? Yeah, that's my second activation. So I'm really rubbish at um, telling I'm about to do my second. Yep. Not spent. How many wounds this guy got? Three. Okay. We'll shoot him. Yep. Crit. Oh, crit and a hit. I need one of those two. Who is this? One dodge. 
So I can't stop it. I stopped the hit. One damage. Crit. One damage. Oh, oh, oh. I know, right? <laughs> Grind them down. Alpha in. Who charged? So needs a charge counter. Uh, yeah, I'm going to use my card. Strike in concert. Oh, hang on. Can I... You can do one first. Tell me about driven back. Can I drive back somebody that I just beat and did damage to? Oh, if you deal damage, you then check if the target's taken out of action, then you drive back. So I guess you can, yeah. You can yeah, damage. okay. I will drive you back, but I will also snare you as part of that, so you'll take an extra point of damage. Okay. Do so I choose where you go? Yeah, as long as I'm further away from you. Okay. Cool. And that you get extra point of damage because of the gambit. Yeah, so that's up to two. Okay, that well, screwed me up a little bit. I think this was one of the mechanics that we need to get better at. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, it definitely Because it matters a lot, doesn't it? It does. And we're not doing it nearly as much as we could. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, well, I've got to do my scything attack with my leader. I mean, that's my best bet. Yeah. For my third activation. So that's... Yeah, three on swords. So I'm going to go here first. Yeah. So that's a crit and a success. I don't think I can better that. Mm -hmm. So he just Can't dies, doesn't so, he? Yeah, that is two damage. That is just dead. And then for and the glory. Sneaky McSnake. Three successes. You can crit out that away. That's three successes? You're on hammers, mate. Oh, yeah. No, I'm on swords. Oh, yeah, you got both. I've got both, yeah. One's a ranged attack. Right, so the I can ranged attack this. is on hammers, and the close is on swords. That's no, not okay. Great. Cool. Okay, so two dice as well. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Whoa. Two glory. And you have one more activation. Yeah, one left. Right. Uh, Fat Boy is going to charge. Okay. To here. Yep. And he's going to bash you on the head. Okay. With his mucho many options. So. He's got two attacks on hammers. And an extra wound. Two damage. An extra wound and a magic attack. Yep. <laughs> none of which matter. But he does have his ritual token that he can use to roll an extra dice. Okay. Yeah. So you can spend that extra dice now? I think so. What would this be in the last action of the game for yeah, me? Yeah, that could be good could be before the attack roll remove a ritual counter okay yeah. cool on hammers uh yeah <laughs> so one. one one success and i've got a crit yeah yeah and you have one activation i do that activation what i really wanted to do with it let's get to objective one um <laughs> which i now no longer can and I can't kill him. He's got five wounds. Yeah, I'll charge. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I have one dodge. Okay. What do I use? Uh, it's just you a, can't do five damage, so it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. No. no? no that's that. That's that. End step. Yep. Because that was turn three, wasn't it? It was. Well, I held objective one. Yep. Uh, I have three members of my force with um, move or charge tokens. Oh, nice. <laughs> what else you got? Because I'm one ahead right now. I have not eliminated all enemy fighters. Neither have I. <laughs> <laughs> and I have one or more surviving fighters for survival of the fittest. It's like there've got to be five dead models, and I have to have at least one left. <laughs> Score this in an end phase if there are one. You got it by one. Me, I just got it by one by victory one, point one, at the very that, end. This dumbass objective. Dumbass objective. I think there's a lot of dumbass Jules, objectives in here. Score this in an end phase. Is that generic? No, that's just for you. Score in an end phase if there are four. There are one or more surviving, but five or more out of action. Of, of so anybody. There's one. You just need one. Wow. 
And it was the fittest too. Any firefighters though. Yeah. Are out oh. of action. I have to have somebody left. Right. And any five left. So win by one. Well, that was interesting. These war Close. bands play very different they from do. the other two, <laughs> don't they? Super quick. And quite punchy. Yeah. Not, not really punchy, but Only very quick. Three wounds on this character. Yeah, that was a surprise. Weird. All right. Well, thank you for the game, James. Yeah, we'll excellent. definitely get some more of those yeah. in, I think. Please remember to like, comment, share or subscribe this video. And if you are buying new games or new miniatures, please consider following our affiliate link to Wayland Games. It gives us a little bit of kickback and helps fund other projects for the channel. Thank you for watching.